just Marxist Leninists. That's all we've called ourselves. We're Marxist Leninists, but it is our view that in the Western context, to make that understandable to the Western mind and to translate Marxism Leninism to the West, you need Heidegger. They don't need it in Russia and China and stuff because they have reality, right? They have reality itself because they have a sacred and unspeakable understanding of their civilizational, national, fam, whatever reality. They don't need Heidegger. The West, right? Because we're all Cartesian and abstract individuals, we need thinkers like Heidegger to make sense of Marxism Leninism. And to me, Marxism Leninism isn't some abstract formal doctrine uh, to us. It's an index of real experience and tradition in history. Okay? So let's first let's first dispel this idea that Marxism Leninism is a set of axiomatic ten. No, that's what the Anglos think, right? That's what they think. But in reality, Marxism Leninism is just a word. Marxism Leninism is just a word that is an index of definite historical, political, and so on tradition. Okay? The way Marxism Leninism is able to make sense outside the West is very different from how we have to make sense of it here. You think I like you think I began as a Heideggerian, I like having to deal with all this shit? No. But you have to to make sense of it in the West. Otherwise, you're gonna run into confusion. And what I'm saying is that's why in the West they don't get far. Marxists are full of confusion. All sorts of assumptions they make and they draw all sorts of stupid conclusions and Marxists are unable to get anywhere in the West. Why? Because people in the East can take things for granted that in the West you can't. So you have to deal with this schizo shit just to make sense of ordinary simple reality outside the West. Heidegger's whole point is the critique of modern Cartesian idealism. What do you think Marx means when he says men and women enter into relations independently of their consciousness? It's literally up the, up the same alley. Marx was the first Heideggerian. It's the same thing they're dealing with. The primacy of being. The primacy of being is something Marx and Heide Marx lays out very explicitly. For Marx, material being. But what is material? Well, material is essential. It's content. Material is not substance, like how the Anglos are trying to twist and turn and make it seem like what Marx means by material is dead facts. It's not what Marx means. Marx doesn't mean dead sense impressions by material. Marx means what actually is. It's a deeper understanding of being. What do you think Marx is referring to if not material being? Being. Being. 